what is up you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Lena Sose and I'm here to slay okay <laughs> okay so guys as usual I'm starting with my eyebrows already done and I am priming my eyelids with my usual P Louise base in the shade number five and right now all I'm doing is using a fluffy brush to tap off the excess as well as blend the product so that the eyeshadows come out smooth and blends properly if that makes sense and then I'm going in with my Juvia's Place Warrior 2 palette I've been wanting that palette for a very long time and I finally got it and I am not disappointed I'm never ever disappointed in Juvia's Place okay maybe a little bit in only one product so far if you guys watched my last uh, video that I posted you guys would know what product I'm talking about I will link that video somewhere in this one so that you guys can go check it out if you didn't already but for the most part I am very much satisfied with my Juvia's Place products and I am really ever disappointed so right now all I am doing is packing that dark brown color in my crease and now I am blending out that dark brown color with the orangey shade in that palette And before I go in to cut my crease, I'm using an even darker brown shade to deepen up my crease from that same Warrior 2 palette. And now the time has come to cut my crease. As you guys can see, I'm taking my time with this. I am not the best at cutting my crease. Sometimes I get it at the first try and sometimes I have to keep going in to keep trying to perfect that line. But you all get the drift. And if you guys hear backing in my background, I am so sorry. But these dogs, I have dogs my neighbor has dogs that literally never keep quiet they always back in they're actually quiet right now compared to normal but yeah just a little off topic but um back to cutting the crease as you guys could see in that previous clip i looked up to see where I should cut my crease this little trick places a nice little marker right above your crease and this helps to prevent your eyeshadows from transferring into your crease after it's been applied hopefully that makes sense this is the best way I can explain Okay, right now I'm placing a gold eyeshadow on to my eyelids and this is going to serve as a base for the glitter that I'm going to apply later and that gold shade that I'm using as you guys can see is coming from the Nomad palette from Juvia's Place. 
and just so that the glitter properly adheres to my eyelids i'm using the anastasia beverly heel glitter adhesive this stuff is really good you guys you should try it since i got it i have never used any of my other glitter glues and then i'm using some glitter from superglitters.com this is their fine glitter I can't remember the shade I'll list it down below in the description box but then I'm going right on top with some lash glue so that I can apply my chunky glitters the chunky the chunky glitters is from fluttered by row.com these glitters are so pretty you guys the camera is not doing it justice I got this gold color and a, a few different ones i can't wait to show you guys and yeah next i am just moisturizing my face to prepare for foundation and i'm not going to show you guys my entire foundation routine just because i plan on filming a foundation routine for you guys and also if i did my foundation routine on camera this video would be like 20 to 30 minutes long and ain't nobody got time for that <laughs> okay all right <laughs> If you guys have watched any of my favorites video you will know already that I love me this fit me foundation but this I am magic foundation from Juvia's place is also very very good I love it I this is probably like my second or third time using it the first few times I I didn't know how to use it because I don't really use full coverage foundations but as you guys can see it I'm blending this thing I'm blending it and in the end it's gonna look like my skin so yeah I'm, it's growing on me I'm loving it and yeah you guys should try it it's a really nice foundation i must say So yeah guys, this is the finished look and ba -da -ba -ba -ba, I'm loving it. <laughs> Anyways you guys, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye. Sandy, ha ha ha! Watch how we flip it, watch how we flip it now.